Hello, I'm Keith Lampkin and I'm Medairn's Senior Climatologist and Agricultural Meteorologist. And that means I spend an awful lot of my time working in that area where meteorology and agriculture overlap. Now, 12 years ago when I started working for Medairn, I was working for our biggest weather station down at Valencia Observatory, Carasavine and Kerry. And here we do an awful lot of state-of-the-art earth science measurements. We monitored the atmosphere up to the edge of space using weather balloons. We monitored the destruction and now the slow recovery of the ozone hole. And we also monitor the amount of solar radiation getting to the earth as well, which is vitally important for crop growth and agriculture. And it was here that I was first introduced to the International Phonological Gardens. This is a network of genetically cloned trees that were planted across Europe in the early 1960s. And by painstakingly monitoring the growth phases of these trees over the last half a century, we've been able to determine that the growing season in Ireland is increasing and has arguably become one of the most important biological indicators of climate change in Ireland. Now, I guess it's fitting I'm talking to you here today from a greenhouse here at the National Botanic Gardens because it's that very same greenhouse effect that's warming our planet. In these warming temperatures, we're seeing a change in the type of agricultural pests and diseases that are encroaching into Ireland. Some of these diseases are brought in on the wind from overseas. But with our atmospheric dispersion models, we're able to monitor and in some cases identify the risks of these potentially airborne incursions into Ireland. Now it's weather and climate that directly affects the grass growth here in Ireland and hence directly affects beef and dairy sectors. And it's that same weather and climate that also influences the variety and type of crops that we grow here in Ireland. So the next time you sit down for a nice meal, maybe you'll spare a thought for the months of weather that likely we're to be producing it.